All right, here we go. Continuing our study of Moodle. Last video we set up groups. Now we are going to add an activity. And according to my list of things to do, we are going to add a wiki for the introduction. Now this is going to be a um, wiki. So you add it under uh, activity wiki. This is going to be an activity where the students are going to work collaboratively as a unit to be able to create their introduction. So, um, and they're going to take what they discussed in the forums and they're going to actually implement it into this introduction. So, take what you've learned and use it here to build your introduction. Okay, and this is set to groups. Now, let's say I'm not entirely sure what this type button means. I can, of course, still hit the question mark. And look at this. It says there are three types of wiki, teacher, groups, and student. So there's one where the teacher can create it and edit it and change it. Um, and then so on and so forth. The one that I want is here, square in the middle. Separate groups, groups. There is one wiki per group. Students can view and edit the wiki of their own group only. Um, I could look at this one, but here with the separate groups teacher, only the teacher can edit it, and the separate group student, every student has their own wiki. So the one that I want for this particular project is this one right here. Now if I forget, later and I'm doing another project or another thing and I want some kind of functionality I can just click on that question box and get right back to this help menu again. Group mode, separate groups, visible and ID number I'm just going to leave blank again. Save and display. Make sure it looks like I want it to look like. And there you go. Take what you've learned and use it here to build your introduction. You can view edit, look at the links from, okay that's cool, so see where the link from, this is inactivated in all Moodles, and um, the history of the page, so this is where I as a teacher can go in and see how many times student A edited it and so on and so forth. Pretty nifty, wouldn't you say? Well, today we've talked about wikis and how to create a wiki that's used by groups of students that the students can edit.